Hey, what's going on, guys? It's the Shocknator here, and today we are back with another Black Ops 3 gameplay. Playing some Awakening DLC live with the Razorback. Oh, got him. Didn't see that shit coming. Oh, got him. Didn't see that shit coming. Uh, but yeah. Oh, got him. He didn't see that shit coming. Um, so like I said, raise. Oh, I didn't see that coming. I didn't see. That I definitely did not see coming. So I want to know in the comments. Oh, we got our hater. What you guys think so far of the Awakening DLC, whether you like it, whether you don't like it, what's your favorite map, what's your least favorite map, and uh, why? Uh, for me personally, um, it, it's a hard choice because, frankly, I haven't gotten to play this too much, right? Like, I've been playing, sure, but not nearly enough to warrant judgment, essentially, on any of these maps. I love... Skyjacked, you know, it's hijacked remade. It looks the same or it looks very different is what I meant to say But it plays similarly But it still incorporates the new movement system, which I think they did beautifully I was really worried that in doing this map They were really gonna mess that up with uh, the new movement system in black ops 3 and everything But I think they've done an excellent job of uh, sort of remastering this map keeping it the same while making it uh, More interesting and sort of not you know, so cuz like with ones like studio uh, instead of firing range and so on and so forth They were basically the same map reskinned and like that's the whole point with remakes sure I can't believe that guy killed me I was on a streak That's the whole point of remakes. I understand but at the same time like you do want to play a different map You know I, if I wanted to play firing range I could go back to black ops 1 and play it um, Studio like studio is look nice to look at you know I think that's that's something that did really well on these maps as, as well is the fact that the colors just pop they're so nice. They're so pretty. Um, so that is definitely, it's just fun to walk around looking at the different maps. Because there's so much color. Even like hijacked right now. Like even this, you know, sort of dark gray, red, and blue. But it still looks really nice. And we're, we got smoked. Oh, if that guy had killed me, I would have. He would have seen some nader rage right there. Holy crap. Slid past him. I hate people who sit in that corner. I've played this map exactly like six, not even six, probably like four times. Every single person who sits in that corner, oh my god. They just do it, and it's like the most OP spot of all time. And they just keep going back there every single life. And it's like, what are you doing? Let's see if we can't get a nice little... Okay, thank you, teammate. Oh, no. Oh, this is going to turn out poorly, I can already tell. Let's see if we can call in this UAV. Yes. Oh, wow. All right. Let's do it. So we got that hater on the, on the, in the sky. On the sky. It's in the sky. It's not on the sky. So let's see just how much damage we can do at this A flag. Looks like that's all it's going to be. So they're going to flip. Oh, and the round's actually almost over. That's extremely unfortunate, isn't it? <laughs> well... We got our hater and stuff for next round, so that's actually okay. Alright, boys, we are back for round two. We got our hater ready to go. We got our power core ready to go. Let's see if we can't do a little wally wall run over here. And a little jumpy jump jump over here. And a little spray them down from the back and the side over there. We only got one of them, but that's alright. That's all we really needed. That's all we really wanted. All we really deserved. Okay, teammate, you are just going balls to the wall in the A spawn. And this is the unfortunate part about playing with randoms is that they inevitably capture every single flag on the map. Like, what are you doing right now, you random? See, now these enemies are, they're worried. They don't know what to do. They're all running up this side and I'm gonna die unless my teammate can kill one, distract him while the other is reloading. So it looks like we got some enemies on the other team who are refusing to join in. That's the other thing I hate about Black Ops 3. And I feel like it's a, it's a Black Ops 3 thing that people do is like, they just do not join the game. They they just sit and wait. And they make, sh like, essentially making sure that no one else can join the game. But not actually, like, doing anything. Alright, so it looks like our team is just... Okay, there's two people. Two enemies. Which means we are not going to get this nuclear. Unless this man caps C. Which he must absolutely do. Cap C, come on, man. Yes, there you are. There you have it. Perfect. Don't you just love when the enemies work out for you? 
Alright, but it looks like our teammates are going to cap it anyway. Now, this is obviously horrible. Triple capping teammates are the bane of my existence in Call of Duty, as many of you may know from just my existence. Did we really get... Where did I kill that other guy? I have zero clue. Um, hopefully they cap A, actually. That would be nice. Let's see if we can't take this guy out on the side. Let's see if we can't take this guy out on the side. And take this guy out on the side. And take this guy out in the middle. Oh, we are just going bananas right now. We are pretty close to our nuclear as well. So, oh my goodness, drop shot him for the nuclear. That was far too close. We got it. We got a little bit of time to make it into a wee little gun streak. So let's just see how much we can do. Boom, got him. Oh, this guy's in the middle, not for long. I will just spray him around that corner. Spray that man right off his spawn point. Look at the unstoppable metals coming in. Oh, Destructinator, the unstoppable. I like the ring of that. They are all on C right now. Holy moly. I, you know, I, I thought about not challenging it and I thought, eh. What the heck? And challenged it. And it was the wrong idea. And sometimes, you know, that's gonna happen. Also, I got the nuclear already, so like, whatever, yo. Alright, hope you guys enjoyed that nice little Razorback nuclear on Skyjack. Make sure to leave a comment down below letting me know what you think of these new maps. Whether you like them, whether you don't, your favorite. My name is Instructinator, and I'll see you guys later.